strengthened her faith and equipped her for the future that God has planned for her. One of Caden's favorite verses is John 14, 2 through 7. Peace I leave with you. My peace I give you. I do not give it to you as the world gives. Do not let your hearts be troubled. And do not be afraid. Ladies and gentlemen, Miss Caden Bradley. Our 10th grade representative. Susie is the daughter of Jeff and Melanie Robinson. She's being escorted tonight by her father. Susie's thankful for her parents who encourage her to fixate her eyes on Jesus, no matter the circumstance and family and friends who love at all times. She says MCA is a place where the teachers love you like their own, where friends turn into family, and you're inspired to further an intimate relationship with Jesus Christ. A favorite verse of Susie's is Philippians 4, 6. Do not be anxious about anything, but in everything by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving, let your request be made known unto God. Ladies and gentlemen, Miss Susie Robinson. Miss <laughs> Madison Reeves. Madison's parents are Brandon and Lisa Reeves, and she's being escorted tonight by her father. Madison says MCA has impacted her life by surrounding her with godly people and teachers and the chapels and speakers that have taught her life lessons, making her relationship with Christ and others stronger. She's a thankful, so thankful for her family, who's always supportive, and for the opportunity to, in, to attend MCA where she's been able to form lasting friendships. She loves Proverbs 4.23. Above all else, guard your heart, for everything you do flows from you. Ladies and gentlemen, Miss Madison Reeves. Our first senior representative tonight is Miss Bella Cranford. Her parents are Dwayne and Denise Cranford. She's being escorted tonight by her dad. Bella's thankful for her family, who has contributed to who she is, and for the Lord who has molded her to the vessel he created her to be. She feels that MCA has impacted her life to the teachers and coaches' genuine care for her future. In her words, they are living examples of Christ who lead her to him every day. Her favorite verse is John 8, 36. If the Son sets you free, you shall be free indeed. Miss Bella Cranford. Tracy <laughs> Shambling. She's the daughter of Eric and Kelly Shambling. Her father is escorting her tonight. Gracie's thankful for a loving and forgiving Savior and for family and friends that encourage and support her. She feels that MCA has impacted her life through the Christ-centered atmosphere, strengthening her relationship with the Lord. A verse she loves is 2 Corinthians 12, 9. But he said to me, My grace is sufficient for you, for my power is made perfect in weakness. Therefore, I will boast all the more gladly about my weaknesses, so that Christ's power may rest on me. Ladies and gentlemen, Miss Gracie Shamblin. <laughs> Being escorted tonight by her father, and also representing the is Miss Grace Stokey. Grace is the daughter of Paul and Michelle Stokey. She's thankful for supportive parents who taught her to always put the Lord first and who display unconditional love. She credits Metrolina for helping her grow in her relationship with the Lord and for creating lifelong friendships. One of her favorite scriptures is Colossians 4, 13 and 14. Forgive as the Lord forgave you and over all these virtues put on love 
which binds them all together in perfect unity. Ladies and gentlemen, Miss Grace Stokey. The last senior rep, Woodbensee. <laughs> Campbell's parents are James and Jenny Woodbensee. She's being escorted tonight by her dad. Campbell is thankful for the redeeming love of Jesus Christ and the ability to be a light for him to all the world around her. She's grateful that MCA has given her the opportunity to sharpen and grow her walk with Christ and feels blessed by wonderful teachers and friends. Her favorite verse is Psalm 27, 13 and 14. I remain confident of this, that I will see the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living. Wait for the Lord patiently. Be brave and courageous. Miss Campbell Woodbensee. Ladies and gentlemen, would you join me tonight in congratulating all of our homecoming court representatives. Now I'd like to welcome back to MCA our 2016 homecoming queen, Miss Caitlin Reeves. Caitlin's the daughter of Brandon and Lisa Reeves. He's currently attending South Piedmont Community College pursuing a degree in sonography. Her favorite scripture is Psalm 27, 14, which says, wait for the Lord, be strong and take heart, and wait for the Lord. Once again, welcome back Caitlin Reeves tonight. At this time, I'd like to ask that all of our senior representatives please step forward as we prepare to announce our 2017 homecoming queen. Our senior class, 2017 homecoming queen is Miss Bella Cranford. Oh, yes, we gotta get all those pictures, you know. 